Hey guys, so this is for the alto saxophone players. We're on the E flat team right now. I'm just gonna approach this book for a second. I'm in my scales on page 51. And I'm going to look at the concert E flat major scale. So because you guys are on the E flat major team, we start on a different note. So we're actually going to start on a C. And we have zero sharps or flats in our key signature, which means that all of our notes are going to be natural. That's important because you technically play a lot of F sharps, but we're going to play F naturals in this one. So here I go, I'm going to play this one for you. And I have my octave key on for every note of that scale except the first and the last one, okay? So then the next one I'm going to do is my concert A flat major. In concert A flat major, if I take a look over here, this key signature has a single flat. This is our B flat. I know it's B flat because it's actually on the middle line, so every good boy deserves fudge. That's the middle line there. On this one, it starts on our low F, and it walks up to the high F. Not F sharp again, it's still F natural, but your B flat fingering, if you check the back of the book, we want this one. We want the A plus this bottom knuckle key right here. So there's three knuckle keys on the side. We want the bottom one, and when I play it, I actually just kind of roll to it. See that action right there? So when I'm playing this one, what I need to be aware of is when I play my A, I go just my knuckle key add-on, but then when I go up to the C, I actually have to take off this finger and my knuckle key at the same time. So here I go. So that's your concert A flat major. And then the last one in here is the concert F major. So it's this one here. This is the one I want to look at. It has two sharps and I'm actually going to play up to this high one right here. I want to play the high, I want to play in the high octave, not the low one. That's just my personal preference. Um, when I play this though, my two sharps here tell me the first one's on the top line. That's my F sharp. And then we're used to that one. And then in this one here, the third space from the bottom up is a C sharp. So my fingering for the C sharp is no fingers at all. What a fun note to play on the saxophone, so awesome. Um, my normal F sharp, and then this really high one right here. Let me take a look at it. It's actually in brackets. Uh, I've got a high C sharp, so no fingers, just my octave key. Then I've got this one right here, which is my high D. That is this really fun, we call it a palm key on the saxophone. <clears throat> so this is my top hand, and I'm actually going to take this part of my hand right here and play this key, so it looks like this. I just kind of nudge it. So when you see this one <clears throat> in action, I'll see if I can turn so I can show you what I'm doing, if you can kind of see it. I'm going to start on the bottom, so I'm starting on my D. And that's the scales of the ultra saxophone. Thanks, guys. See you in a bit.